Now, the Lokayukta is conducting raids across five places in Bengaluru. The Lokayukta has also raided the residence and office of MSILMD Harikumar Jha, the deputy director of KSRTC. Padmanabh's residence is also being raided. Now, very often, uh, sleuths from the Lokayukta conduct raids based on tip offs that uh, certain government officials have income disproportionate to their known sources of income, that is. In fact, the Lokayukta is conducting raids across five places in the city. The Lokayukta has also raided the residence and office of MSILMD Harikumar Jha. The deputy director of KSRTC Padmanabh's residence is also being raided. There you can see Harikumar Jha IFS. Now his house is being uh, raided, not just his house, but also his office. Now Harikumar Jha is the MD of MSIL. Now he's not the only high-ranking official to be raided this morning, the deputy director of KSRTC. Padmanabh, his residence is also being raided by sleuths from the Lokayukta. In fact, you can see the uh, Lokayukta sleuths uh, outside the house. Now, we are told that uh, this raid will go on. In fact, the operation will go on uh, for the entire day. Now, the state wing of the Congress is probing the reasons for its defeat in the Lok Sabha polls. Take a look as to how it plans to do so. Although the result in Karnataka turned out to be the Congress's best in the country, the performance here was also below expectation. The state wing of the Congress is seeking reports from all the district presidents. KPCC President G. Parmeshwar called for a meeting of all the district presidents today at the KPCC office. Congress Congress Adam Melama, Avisbera Sidar, Padadi Karigulu Kuda, Jilegalege, Auru Kuda, Betty Kotida, and ex under Dele Ali, Gumpugari Kedre, Matu, Viroda, Madita Kata, then Adrumahiti, Dre, Adana, Urinda Nukuda, Parkorte. The KPCC president has adopted a three tire system to seek reports. First, a meeting will be held with the candidates who have won and lost in the election. That will be followed by a meeting of office bearers. The district presidents will then submit their reports. A notice is expected to be sent to the ones responsible for the loss following examination of reports. After seeking replies from people who have been served notices, action is expected to be taken. The State Congress has received several complaints from many districts following the loss. The party is hoping that this move will help them identify the reason behind the dismal performance. Sukesh for News 9, Bengaluru. Now, in a dramatic turn of events, focus on the case of the tainted ADGP and his alleged attempt to click obscene photos of a girl in a coffee shop has now shifted to Bengaluru Police Commissioner Raghavendra Auradkar. Following allegations of misconduct against him, the ADGP P. Ravindranath now seems to have the undaunted support of his home department, the Karnataka State Reserve Police. <laughs> Hundreds of KSRP members protested at their head office in Ardagodi, demanding that the Bengaluru Police Commissioner Raghavendra Auradkar visit the spot. The reason their tainted superior claims innocence and has instead pointed the finger at Auradkar, stating that he was framed. Commissioner Raghavendra Auradkar is involved. He is trying to frame me. He has already framed me. Now, 
ADGP Ravindranath was accused of clicking obscene pictures of a young girl at a cafe on May 26th. But following his breakdown and claims of innocence, the KSRP protesters were in full support of their superior. They seem to be just as convinced by the ADGP's theory of Auratkar conspiring against him. <laughs> Medical test is a Medinova Medical Center. Bare Vetigol, Uran and Anna Tildagi, Arun, Arthingal in the one worship in the Uran of Watch Marta Dare, Urna Shedan Turkey, six back and the Arthingal in the one worship in the Watch Marta Dare, and the Uru first day Medina was entering Vodaga, second day Uru first day a plan Madidru, first day a plan Madi Medina was entering with Bandidru, without Fudal Bandidru, Nale with the Fudal Bande Bertare, Bandantre, Kafi Barik Bande Bertare, Kafi Barik Bandantra, pre plan Agi, Uri Agdidanta. The angry KSRP protesters only took it down a notch after Joint Commissioner Kamal Panth along with the Deputy Commissioners of Bengaluru Police visited the spot. But some KSRP members continued with a silent protest demanding that the Commissioner of Police himself visit the spot. The ADGP seems to have managed to shift the focus from the fact that obscene pictures of the victim were actually found on his phone. In his defense, Ravindranath states that it was all a premeditated move of the commissioner to malign him. Instead of letting the Bengaluru police conduct investigations and gather evidence, here is what Ravindranath did. He walked into Auratkar's cabin and demanded he be arrested based on the victim's complaint. The commissioner declined, stating that this authority only lies with the investigating officer. Moreover, immediate arrests after registering an FIR are only conducted when the offence is cognizable or if they have enough evidence against the accused. Home Minister K.J. George says that there will be no arrests until they have enough evidence to get an arrest warrant. Meanwhile, the state government has sought the intervention of the CID to ensure that the investigations are not clouded in further controversy. While many might state that the whole case is nothing more than a middle-aged man allegedly clicking obscene pictures of a young girl some have stated that it is in fact a conspiracy to malign a senior KSRP officer. All in all, one can only hope that despite the high profile nature the case has developed into, the victim gets justice. Vishnu Prasad with Kiran, News 9, Bengaluru. Now a car rammed straight into a truck in Gulbarga. Four of the commuters have been killed on the spot. The deceased are natives of Solapur. They have been identified as Kundiba, Vishnu, Preeti and Shruti. Now, the family was returning after a pilgrimage to Tirupati. In fact, uh, those are the pictures that we secured. You can clearly see that the truck was in the right uh, direction, but uh, not the SUV wherein these commuters were on their way after heading to a pilgrimage to Tirupati. Now you can see your uh, relatives, some of them extremely distraught to hear uh, about what happened. Well, as of now, we're told that uh, the jurisdictional police in Gurbaga are looking into this particular case. In fact, we're told that this accident took place in the early hours of the morning. Now, four people have lost their lives. They have been identified as Kundiba, Vishnu, Preeti and Shruti. Family was returning after a pilgrimage to Tirupati. Now, there were two brothers who chose an entirely different line of work, but now their paths have crossed. Take a look as to who we are talking about. Meet D.V. Suresh, a senior station master, Nandikuru Railway Station in Udupi, Taluk. Do you know whose sibling Suresh is? Well, Suresh serves as a station master, but his brother is a railways minister. D.V. Sadananda Gowda, the railways minister, in the nearly sworn-in cabinet, is Suresh's elder brother. Suresh joined the railways in 1985 and has worked in many stations, including Goa, Pune and Hubli, as the assistant station master. Suresh has now completed four years of service as a senior station master in Nandikuru railway station. 
His brother's elevation has brought joy to him. He says that Sadananda Gowda has not changed a bit despite becoming a cabinet minister. Even when Sadananda Gowda was the MP from Udupi Chikmagluru Lok Sabha constituency, he made sure to drop by at Suresh's house whenever he visited the constituency. <laughs> Godfather is the same as the Godfather. He is a guru. He is a minister of the department. He is a prestigious institution. He is a minister of the department. He is a minister of the department. He is a Members of Suresh's family are awaiting Sadananda Gowda's visit. Preparations are in full swing as he is expected to visit next week. Suresh has got the opportunity to work in the ministry headed by his own brother. But he says that the elevation of his brother as a railways minister will not change the way he functions. Arabilachi Yogaraj, News 9, Udupi.